Okay, I think I'm live. Oh, I'm live. Hi, hi, everyone. Okay, I'm gonna give it a second to see if people hop on. This was totally not uh, planned. <laughs> so if no one joins, that's totally cool. I'm really just going to be talking about the Summer Savings Challenge, which starts on Sunday. And I'm so excited. So I wanted to just hop on and share a few things with the City Girl Savings Facebook group. So I see one person on. Hi. If you're here with me, definitely say hello. And we will give it another minute before we get started. I can't believe the week is almost over. I can't believe we are past the halfway point of June. Can't believe it is summer. What is going on? Why is time going so fast? <laughs> uh, okay, so we're a minute in. This video will be in the Facebook group, so it doesn't matter if you're here live or not. I just wanted to hop on and share that the third annual Summer Saving Challenge officially starts on Sunday, and I'm super excited. I have been doing this specific challenge for the past three years. Well, this will be the third year. And if you are new to the City Girl Savings community or you are not aware of what this challenge is, it is basically a free, like totally free, four week savings challenge where every week for four weeks, I send out a specific goal amount that all of us who are participating will save for that week if possible, right? Some things come up and you may not be able to save your full goal amount or you may be able to save above and beyond the goal amount. That works too. But the whole point is that over the course of the next four weeks, you are saving extra money, totaling at least $250, which can be used for whatever you want it to be used for. I would challenge you to really think about what you do want to save for, if there's something you need, if you've got to buy something for yourself, if you want to make an extra debt payment, whatever your goal is, really think about that and use that to to serve as motivation over the next four weeks as we save the $250. So Summer Saving Challenge starts on Sunday. You get a new goal amount every week for four weeks, totaling $250 at the end of the four weeks. Um, I'm doing something a little different this year. Um, the past two years I've done this, I have just transferred money into uh, an extra savings account. This year I'm actually gonna use Digit. And I'm pretty sure if you've signed up, you've heard me talking about Digit, but basically Digit is an app that links to your checking account and it has this algorithm to determine exactly how much money it can pull out of your checking account and move to your Digit savings account so that you don't go negative in your checking account. So small amounts of money are transferred from your checking account to your Digit account just to help you save more. So this year I'm gonna be using Digit to help me save for the Summer Savings Challenge. I created a little account that says Summer Savings Challenge, cute little emoji umbrella, super excited. Um, what I'm going to do is kind of let Digit do its thing over the course of the week. So we'll know the exact goal amount at the start of the week. I'm gonna let Digit do its thing, transfer money from my account to my Digit account. If at the end of the week, Digit didn't transfer enough to meet the goal, I will do my own transfer to meet that goal amount. If Digit saves more, awesome, I'm here for it. So that's how I plan to use Digit this year to save the $250. So definitely consider that if you have trouble like transferring money between actual accounts or if you don't have a new separate savings account just for this challenge. So. I'm super excited about that. Um, over the course of the four weeks, we will be saving a lot of money. And I do wanna note that this is on top of any normal budgeted savings. So if you already have automatic transfer set up, this summer savings challenge is really on top of that. So for example, if you have $100 a month already transferred from checking the savings and the goal amount for the summer savings challenge is $250, you're still going to do your normal $100 transfer, but you're also going to save the $250 over the course of the four weeks. So again, save what you can. The goal is just to do more, do above and beyond what you're currently doing. Be mindful of where your money is going, save instead of spend, 
and really just get you pumped and ready for next month, for the summer month. So super excited. We have about 500 people already in the challenge, which I'm super excited about, but there are 2,000 members in this Facebook group, which means that 1,500 of you have not signed up for the challenge. So it's totally free. There's really no reason why you wouldn't want to sign up. Um, I have included the link in the description of this video, but it's all over the Facebook group. So definitely sign up if you haven't. We start on Sunday with the first goal amount. And in about four weeks, we will all have an extra $250 saved. So I'm super excited. If you guys have questions, just leave them in the group, leave them in uh, a comment on this video. I'm here for you guys. I hope you have a great rest of your night and let's get ready to save some money. All right, everyone, I will see you soon. Bye-bye.